What is going on guys, Yeti here, welcome back to another episode of my Pokemon Pearl playthrough. Before we get started, I just need to change the em emulation settings real quick. For some reason, every time I start the recording, that's when it changes the the, the 3D renderer. Anyway, welcome back, uh, I have some information, some news I guess, uh, before we get started for this episode. So I um, decided that I wasn't going to do a naming scheme for my Pokemon, but since I recorded episode 2, which was about a week and a half ago, I've been watching Orange is the New Black and I decided that actually, you know what, naming schemes are cool. The only, I do like naming schemes, the only reason why I didn't have one is just because I couldn't think of anything. But now that I've got this, I figured, you know what, I may as well do it. So we got Chapman, who is our Chimchar, because, you know, Chapman, you know, main character and starter Pokemon, it just sort of goes and then obviously sounds similar, the words. Um, and then we got Morello, who is our uh, former coup. They're also both level 9, Morello's level 9. I'm pretty sure Ku is like a level 3, but um And we got Voss, because I said that I was going to catch a I said I wanted a Luxray on my team, so I figured I may as well just catch a, a Shinx. So I have a Shinx who's level 5, who is Voss, because I don't know, I guess when it's Luxray it's like a dark and I, I don't know, I guess they kind of look similar, I guess. And then Morello. I don't know, which reminds me of uh, a, a Starly. I guess as in, like, when I was trying to think of a name for Starly, like Morello just came into my mind like straight away. So yeah, that's gonna be my naming scheme for the series. I also fixed the like the top of the like, each of the the captures, each of the screens had like a line on top. Um, it was worse than the bottom screen, but basically yeah, I fixed both of those, so they're not there anymore. Um, and obviously, there's a small disadvantage with this in the um, obviously the characters are all female. However. We can avoid like all the fights here. Oh, a cave? I'm not looking forward to that. Orberg City, okay. Um, yeah, I can, I can try to just catch. Ooh, what are we gonna do here? I think I'll stick with Chapman. Um, yeah, we can just try to catch a uh, female Pokemon. It's all good, you're a fellow friend of Pokemon, so let me make a gift of this hidden machine for you. Oh, uh, what? You just gave me an HM. This isn't a fight, okay. What is it? Let's see. Hidden machine, uh, Rock Smash. Rock Smash is pretty useful. Okay. Uh, if you don't have that badge, you can't make a Pokemon. Okay, so I can't actually use it yet without the badge. But Rock Smash is good, though, because it's not only, obviously, useful for smashing rocks. But it's actually a pretty powerful move as well. Oh, okay. So, do I wa want a Graveler? So, I hadn't actually planned my team beyond this point. I obviously planned my starter, but I also planned to have a Starly. I just want to see what's up here, actually. Let's walk in here so we get less encounters. Okay, I can't go that way yet, so I'm going to have to do this trainer fight, I think. No, I can go past. I can go past everyone. Right, let's do at least one trainer fight, so I'm not under-leveled. And then I guess if I am under-leveled, I can just come back. To celebrate, celebrate my getting through this cave, I'm going to battle you. I mean, it was a straight line. It was barely even 30 steps, so okay. You're challenged by Picnic and Diana. Okay. But, um, what was I saying? Oh, would you? I haven't seen one of those before. Yeah, so I, I planned my start. I planned uh, to have a Starly because, first of all, uh, I will need something to f for Fly later on, so it'll be good for Fly. But I also quite like Star Raptor, and it's a pretty powerful Pokemon if you use it right. So I think it'll be a pretty cool Pokemon to have on the team. And then Luxray is also, like, really powerful if you, you train it right and teach you the right moves. And uh, it's actually one of my favourite Pokemon, Luxray. Um,. Well, beyond that, that's, that was all I, I actually planned. I'm just going to take the rest of the series as it comes. If I see a Pokemon, I'm like, yeah, I kind of want to catch that. I might catch it. I might get a full team and then see something else I want to catch and end up switching out. I don't know. I know um, previously, or at least in Silver, once I sort of had my team, I didn't actually change it. Now, let's keep battling here. And hope it doesn't use, like, Water Gun or something. Yeah, okay. Well, I think with this one, you know, I don't know exactly where it's going to go. Let's use a lay and then I'll try and scratch it. I think it's better than, than using them because this is, is this, it's a water psychic type, right? Which is actually a, re a really cool, um, I don't know what you call it, like, I don't, I don't know what you call it when you like have two typings together. A really cool synergy. I, don't know, I use that term a lot in Isaac, I don't know what you call it in Pokemon. But yeah, this is a really cool couple of, a couple of um, types to have. I guess, I don't know. Anyway, so this should be, should be uh, go down in one more scratch, and then we can move on. Maybe uh, off camera I'll go back and fight 
like one or two more trainers just at least to get some more XP. Chapman is a level 10 and then Morello is a level 9. Voss is only level 5 but I will train Voss off camera as well. Um, so yeah. Oh if you're wondering how I re- oh there's a fight. Uh, howdy trainer. If you don't have a single gym badge other trainers will look down on you like you're a total noob right? Oh, I never noticed the use of it. Okay, so I'll show you where the town's Pokemon gym is. Okay, let's do it. Oh uh, yeah, if I wonder how I renamed them, I literally restarted the game because I was only two episodes in and it took me about twenty minutes because I was spe I used the speed up. First, someone's there. It's Clint, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So with speed up, it took me like twenty minutes to basically do everything I needed to. Hello, Hun. <laughs> oh, it's you, Vamp. You finally got here. You're slow like always, you're so slow, the gym lead is long gone now. He said he had to go, uh, oh yeah, to Orb, Orberg Mine. I think it's Orberg. Or, or Orb, I don't know. Orberg Mine. Uh, I got my badge already, so it's no big deal to me, but... Okay, so why don't you go to the mine? Well, why are you, like, stood in front? Uh, I should probably heal up real quick, even though we barely took any damage because we fought one person. But still, I may as well at least be on full health. So I realise, actually... The the poke etch having my team down there kind of it, it's kind of weird because I've got my Pokemon like a, just above where I've got my team, but I've already, I, I didn't want to start changing the layout. I like the layout for starters, and I don't know. I just like having the game and the team on the layout, and that's just like the way I like it. So I don't see the point to start changing it. And plus, it, with this, you know, I can, I don't have the names obviously. I just have the health. But I can have the names if I have the layout. So. Is this the way to, to the mine? Orberg City. I feel like it'll be in the city somewhere. Because uh, I could go down here. Let's see. Oh, this is the way. Okay. It's definitely the way. Um, Can I go through here? Oh, Macho. Macho. I said Macho. Macho Choppo. <laughs> For sure, dude. Alright, where's the entrance? It's going to be down here, right? Oh, here we go. We're in. Yee, yeah. what's this? Just, you know, walk into the mine, start stealing this stuff. Uh, an next event, that's actually pretty good. I'll probably end up getting saved until the Elite Four. Oh, there's encounters in there. Okay, that threw me off. I, I went down. I, th I thought that was like a ledge. I thought I was falling off a ledge. <laughs> it's just stairs. <laughs> you genius. Um, yeah, was I saying anything? Oh, yeah, the overlay. Well, I don't know, the Poke Etch is kind of weird. I'm not, I'm not used to uh, having that, obviously, in like silver and stuff. Because I, I could have the time, I don't know, because I was I originally had the time, I feel like it's weird, because then you guys know what time it is. Which, I mean, doesn't really mean anything, but you know. And then, you know, calculator doesn't make much sense. Steps could be interesting, but probably kind of annoying, because it'd be constantly going up. So I think it's better just to have this. I think this makes the most sense, because, you know, it's just something that's there, it's not really a big deal. What are all these, actually? Okay, let's talk to this chap. Uh, everyone that works in the coal mine keeps their own Pokemon with them. You may be challenged to battles. Okay, um, there were Pokemon that looked just like rocks, this oh, Geodudes, okay. Yeah, I thought this thing was like a ledge, oh my god, another freaking battle. I was walking across it, <laughs> I was trying to go underneath the trainer and then I went down the step and it <laughs> threw me off, I thought I like dropped now and I was like, oh, I wasn't ready for that. Okay. Well, you know, if I'm going to be doing it so that I just... Oh, okay, like I said, like basically in silver... When I was playing Silver, once I had my team, it didn't change. But if I'm going to be playing it this time, where if I'm building up my team and then maybe later on I want to change it, then I can. Then what I might do, I might just like catch a Geo dude just to have. Because I may as well have it, and then if I get better Pokemon later on, I can just switch it, if that makes sense. I don't know, we'll see. Okay, stand back and watch this. Using the, the Hidden Move Rock Splash, a boulder block in your way. Fallen boulders need to be smashed so they're out of the way. If you could get the badge from the gym in town, you'd be able to do this too. Of course, you'd have to beat the gym leader first, that'd be me. Is that it? Okay, so I believe if I spoke to one of these dudes, I'd have to do a trainer battle. I could, yeah, let's do a trainer battle. Ooh, a Zubat. That's kind of interesting. My, my reasoning for not getting uh, a Nav 2.0, <laughs> 2. nothing, is... Just because I want to sort of mix it up. I don't have anything against Graveler, and Graveler was a really big help in my silver team. I actually really enjoyed having a Graveler, and I think that it would actually be really good in this playthrough as well. 
But I, I don't know, I wanna I wanna mix stuff up, I don't wanna get the like the same teams every time. So I think I think that's gonna be I think I'm gonna not get Graveler for that reason. Also I didn't do one of the fights even though I said I probably would. Uh let's see how this goes. Cause at the end of the day, I can just cut it out if I fail. Uh see what this guy has to say. Howdy, how's it going, champ to be? Uh that's what I said to a really impatient boy earlier too. The gym leader is a user of rock type Pokemon. Yeah, I don't Oh, the weak's a grass type. The fire type Pokemon won't be easy either. So the advice I could give. This is gonna be a really tough fight, actually. I'm trying to think. Is there even anyone I could catch? Let's fight. Let's see what these dudes or Pokemon these dudes have. Dude, I'm loving how easy it is to just walk past trainers in this game. Maybe that's why this was my favorite game, <laughs> just because you can walk past everyone. But I'm, I'm trying to think. I don't even know how I could make this easy. Because I was thinking, okay. We've got normal and flying type moves. We've got normal moves for Voss, who's only level 5 anyway. And then we've got normal and fire from, from Chapman. This is going to be really sick effect, so I was thinking, oh, maybe I could like go and f catch something, but what would I even catch? Are there any wild bud use nearby? That would maybe help, actually, because that has grass type moves. I don't know when it learns a decent grass type move. I don't want to catch it and have to train it for 20 minutes on speed up to get it to like a level 20 just so I can learn Miracle Seed or something. Not Miracle Seed, Bullet Seed. I don't even know what to do here actually, it's going to be really to fight. Which could be a problem. I could just like... Uh, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to think of some, some like next level strats here. Is flying as useless against rock as I'm thinking? Because we do have wing attack. I didn't actually. We've not used uh, Morello yet, so I haven't actually shown that. But we do. Morello does have wing attack. I wonder if wing attack could actually be useful. I'm actually, not sure. Does he have another Pokemon? Oh, damn. We got a lot of XP for that, though. I definitely will heal. If I win this fight, I'll definitely heal up before I go to the trainer. Oh, an Onyx. You know what? We may as well test it. Let's switch out to Morello. Force is basically useless anyway, because she's only level 5, but even if she was a higher level and she had like spark, you know, it doesn't do anything, so, okay. This is either me being dumb, or, I, just, I mean, that's probably it actually, so let's try a wing attack and see what happens. Please be like super effective or something. It did nothing, awesome. That's exactly what I wanted to happen. This is only level 8 too, it's like, oh fuck, he's using Harden. Actually, if you we, if we just use Harden forever, we'd probably beat it eventually. I think we're best to just speed up here. I'm assuming it has all the moves, it probably has Bide or something. Oh my lord, he's, oh he has Rock Throw, awesome. Super effective. Okay, yeah, neither of these moves are doing anything. Okay, so that didn't work. So even though Ember's not very effective, I think that is I think that that sucks it's not very effective and yet it's probably the best move we have out of all of our Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, well this this could could be interesting. <laughs> no, no. What am I gonna do? Okay. You know what? I'll I'll think it through. We we've we've been through worse, I think. Um Well, you know, the first gym in silver I did fail, didn't I? Yeah, I think that took two goes actually, so you know, even if it's a struggle to do, if I can beat this gym first try, then I'll be doing better than Silver. Oh, that's... Ember's still doing more than Wing Attack. Okay. Hopefully this kills. Please kill. The only other thing I can think of is to get them all to, like, level 18. Just so they're, like, really overleveled. So it'll do a little bit more damage or something. Or make it a bit easier, even though it's, like, not very effective. Chapman's already level 12, I guess, because I did leave a lot of trainers, so I could probably easily get Chapman and maybe Morello to 15 or something. Good, this is humiliating. Oh, okay, maybe not both of them, but I could get level them both up. Oh, I don't want to fight you yet. I want to heal. Half my team's dead. And by half, I mean one of them, but the other one's like half dead, so you know. Uh, so, what I'm actually going to do is I am going to cut here, and then I'll come back when I've figured something out. Okay, what is going on guys? I am back. Shoutouts to Frozen Time. 
um, who is someone on GameFAQ, uh, someone else on uh, the internet had this, a similar problem to me. He had a level 13 Chimchar, um, and he was, try he was trying to evolve his Magikarp so he could use water type moves. Um, and Frozen Time was like, yo dog, you have level 13 Chimchar, level up one more level. You know, first of all, it evolved to a Monferno, which I didn't realise was this soon. But secondly, he said it'll learn Mac Punch, and of course we get a wild Geodude. There's Geodudes everywhere. Anyway, yeah, it's like, it's like the game's trying to sell me something that's like, dude, you really want this nav? Um, you know what, fuck it, let's do it. So we want to get this to, oh shit, we're two levels off, so I guess we want to um, get this to level 14. So whilst I'm just explaining what I'm going to do, I will speed up, and then I'm probably going to cut and come back when I'm level 14. Uh, but yeah, so basically I'm going to level it up, two more levels to get to level 14, um, and then it'll learn Mac Punch, and that is super effective against all his Pokemon. So... Yeah, as soon as that happens, I will, I'll come back, and then we can do the fight. Alright, we are back, and I am not quite level 14 yet, but I found a matchup, and you know what? That's a really cool Pokemon, I freaking want it. So, I think a Machamp would be so awesome to have on the team. Does Machamp evolve by level, or does it need to be... Well, I only be able to get into Map Choke. Either way, this is a really cool Pokemon, and it can be, like, really powerful. So I think I'm going to go for this, and now I'm not entirely sure what I want to name it yet. I'm thinking of... No, I want to catch it. Okay. No, don't go back. Catch it. There we go. I can use last... I have eight Pokeballs. I thought I only had five. Okay. So we will have a few goes at this, fortunately. Well, eight goes. One. Two. You got this? Yeah. So I the first Pokeball, it didn't even shake once, and the second one, it caught it. I think I'm going to call it Boo, just because, you know, Boo's like the, the butch one, the hench one, you know? I don't know, I think it just like suits the best. It is a female, I fought about five males before I found the female. It's muscle never cramp, however much it trains, it lives in the mountains away from humans. I mean, I've not even been anywhere near the mountains yet, and I've seen about to ten of them total. Um, yeah, give a nickname, and we are going to call it... Uh, boo. Okay. Um, uh, oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> I'll come back when I'm level 14. Alright, we are back. Sorry about all the cuts, I know there's been a lot of cuts. I'll try and not do that in the future, but it's just the way it is. We got a Mon Monferno! Oh, dude, this is awesome. I didn't realise it was this early. I thought it'd be like 18 or maybe 16 earlier. I didn't realise it was 14. But anyway, yeah, so we got a uh, Chapman of all the two Monferno, which is awesome. Hopefully, the internet didn't lie, I'm gonna get Mac Punch here. Congratulations, you're Chapman of all the two Monferno. It's a pretty awesome Pokemon. Uh, Chapman wants to learn the move Mac Punch, yes, for sure. Mac Punch is a good move anyway. I'm gonna get rid of Growl, I think, just because I usually tend to not use... Oh, it's Leo we have, not Growl. It was Morello who had Growl, wasn't it? Let's get rid of... It's only Power 40, that's not that much. It's the same as Scratch, really. I didn't even realise. Uh, let's only use attack moves for four turns. Yeah, Taunt's a ter Taunt is a terrible move. Let's get rid of Taunt. I thought I had Growl actually, I was going to get rid of Growl, because I gen tend to not use moves at lower attack uh, anywhere near as much as I use moves at lower defense, but it's fine. So we're going to go ahead and then move back down to the gym, and then we're going to give this a go. We are fully healed because I got down like the fight before leveling up, I only got down to 1 HP, so you know. Let's go ahead and move up here. It's going to be a tough fight still, because we're only level 14, and his highest level Pokemon's level 14. So maybe I should actually be doing trainer battles, because I am kind of underleveled here. Um, but I still do still need to train, um, I'm forgetting names already, Voss and Boo, so I guess we'll do that later on. Welcome, this is the Orberg Pokemon Gym. I am Orberg City Pokemon Gym. I'm Rock, the gym leader. Uh, I'm but one trainer who decided to walk proudly with Rock-type Pokemon, and you're a bitch for doing so. As the gym leader, I need to see your potential as a trainer, and I'll need to see the toughness of the Pokemon that battle with you. So I guess this is still pretty balanced, because obviously Piplup has Water-type moves, um, and then... What's the Grass-type in this game? <laughs> Turtwig has, obviously has Grass-type moves, and then we get Mach Punch here, so I guess it's, it's not too bad, because, you, you know, it's kind of easy. Not easy, but not too bad either way. Okay, in red, the first gym was like a real bitch, unless you chose Squirtle, because if you had Squirtle, you can bubble your way through it, but it was pretty tough. I, I think this, this is still going to be the toughest, even with Mac Punch, but still. I sh probably should have bought some potions, actually, because I don't think I have any. Fortunately, I didn't do that much, though, so if I can 
keep using Mac Bunch. I just don't know if we can actually take on the whole team single-handedly. He does have three Pokemon. I also, um, when I was training up, I fought like a bunch of Geodudes, and they kept using, um, really, gonna do that. Jeez. Uh, they kept using wa Water Spot? No, Mud Spot is called, isn't it? I was just like, that is the most useless move, <laughs> Mud Spot on a Geodude, because Electric Types, Mud Spot uh, weakens Electric Type moves, and Electric Type moves already do literally nothing. So I thought it was kind of funny that they kept using that. It, it, I mean, it was having, like, absolutely no effect. It was making it weaker. Than, than, um, than resistant. It's like negative. It's like if they use an electric move, they gain health or something. Which I actually thought that'd actually be pretty cool, I guess. It wouldn't make any sense, but it'd be cool. Leader Rock is about sending Onyx. I am for sure not shaking. Shaking my Pokemon, changing my Pokemon. What level is this? I actually didn't see. This one's level 12, okay. Yeah, he has a. Is it a Cranidos? Is the first one. Yeah, because then the evolved version is like a, a Ram Rampardos. Yeah, but it has a, a Cranidos, which is pretty cool, actually, to be fair. Oh shit, what is, that's defense, right? Yeah, okay, harshly, that is not good. Let's go ahead and just keep Mac punching it until it hopefully falls down to the ground, unconscious. It is indeed super effective. Stealth Rock. Ooh, that's quite interesting. Okay. I need to be kind of careful now that there's like stealth rocks about. Oh, you bitch. They have way less HP than I think they do. The one potion like nearly fully heals them when they're on just above red. I really hope he doesn't use another potion because we'll just get stuck in an endless cycle of Mac punching and potions. Oh, actually, we're a bit closer this time, so even if he does, we'll probably be fine. Stop using Screech, or this Cranidos is gonna rape me. Okay. One more. Okay, we are. We are sped. That's good. I was worried that he'd use a potion. We wouldn't outspeed the potion. I don't know. I actually genuinely don't know how that works. Outspeeding like item uses. Item uses already go. Always go first, right? Whoa! Holy butt cheeks. That's a lot of XP. Also, I just realised I was training up. In, training in up in some grass like, above the city. I could have just trained against all those trainers that I left behind. Well, actually, no. I'm glad I didn't because if. If I trained against those trainers, I wouldn't have seen that there was matchups in that grass, and I probably wouldn't have got one. But now we have Boo, which is awesome. Okay. Oh, 14 crane nails, this could be interesting. Think you can take down the next Pokemon like you did earlier? Such a random thing to say. Like overly, t oh, overly over the top. Can you be overly over the top? No, you can't really, it's just over the top. Oh wow, that did way more to this than it did to any of the other one. I guess because the other ones were just rock type, this is a rock and ground type. But I, I, I'm not sure if that makes any sense. Holy fuck. Wow, that came out of nowhere. Shit. Um, Morello? Oh, shit. This is so over. Holy crap. I was off to get, like, confident. I was like, wow, I did so much damage. Oh, good. No way, not yet. Not, you better not give a potion. I swear, if he gives it a potion... Use a quick attack. Oh, we are so dead. It outsped, really? I guess it is five levels ahead of us. Oh, this is over. No, I didn't want to cut again. You whore. Okay, I guess I'm going to have to cut again. Shit. No effing way. I was for sure. I. Though it, I can't believe. Boo, you hero. I can't believe I just happened. I for sure thought that was over. I didn't think for a second there was even a chance. Dude, a level 6. I didn't know low kick was super effective. I did What? I didn't even realise. I would have trained Boo up and just been smashing it with Boo. Three levels. We just got three levels from that. Oh my lord. That was. Okay. This can't be my buffed up Pokemon. I... Dude. 
I'm as shocked as you are. Vamp got 1680 for winning. This is embarrassing. I went and lost to a trainer who didn't have a single gym badge. Uh, but that's tough. Well, you're the first gym. Oh, the phone's ringing. Hopefully you guys can't hear that in the background. It is downstairs. Um, but that's tough. You were strong and I was weak. That's all there is. According to the Pokemon League rules, I have to give you our gym badge since you've beaten me, the leader. Here's your official Pokemon call badge. That's pretty cool. I received the call badge from Raw. Dope. Uh, having that call badge means your Pokemon can now use the hidden move Rock Smash outside of battle. Oh, I guess um, Boo will be able to learn that, which is pretty cool. You should also take this to... Let's see what this is, actually. Um, Stealth Rock, okay. Smooth it inflicts damage on foes that switch into battle. Incidentally, a TM will teach its move. Yeah, that was being... I mean, you guys will have seen it, because obviously I was speeding up, but I'm going to leave that footage in now. Because I was going to cut that out and then come back and then try again with Mac Punch, and just Mac Punch our way through. Which is why I speed up, which I because I, I really should have not caught honestly, but I was just like, uh, okay, there's no way that I'm gonna win here because my other two Pokemon aren't even like anywhere near, like they're less than half of his level. I d didn't even think there was a chance. Wow, okay, I'm kind of shocked. I guess we'll carry on then. Well, no, we're not because I know I've had a lot of caught spot. I'm 32 minutes in, so I need to go record some more pearl. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, just leave a like, helps me out more than you can possibly imagine. And then if you love it, favourite it, the playlist will be in the description if you want to catch up on any episodes you've missed. My name's Yeti. I love you all. Peace off, guys.